All right, this was the scene the four months ago after an EF3 tornado ripped through Andover. It caused major damage to the town and the YMCA. And for the first time since that storm, we're getting a look inside the gym and the road to rebuilding. Kiss and Jessica Watson is live there tonight with a look. Jessica. Emily, this is where the entrance of the Andover YMCA once was, and over here is where the administration was and the kids' corner. There's still even some drawings on that wall over there. Today, we got a clear timeline of when this YMCA will be full of people again. The president and CEO of the Greater Wichita YMCA says since the tornado, the organization has been working with other community partners to keep child programs up and running. While the building isn't what it once was, it will will be soon. After working through demolition and insurance, the Y plans to reopen the water park with new features by next summer and the whole facility by spring of 2024. Really appreciate the support because that allows us to, to dream and, and, and keep delivering like just these amazing programs as well as a facility. You know, these, this facility will be one of the best in the country when it's done. So it's great to be able to say it's coming. With parts of the building just gone and scattered and shattered windows throughout the facility, the president says rebuilding will take some time. There is some even some completely totaled and smashed cars in the parking lot here. And I spoke to staff and they say some people just haven't come to pick them up at this point. Now coming up tonight at 10, hear from a member of the Y who was in the facility when the tornado touched down and hear his thoughts about the rebuilding process. Here for you, Jessica Watson, KSN News 3.